here with a 2017 17 plate Mercedes Benz Jolie 250D AMG line 4 Matic. Now, I do have a black Pan America style front grille with a black front badge, LED headlights, as well as a black front splitter. Now, I just come with four superb 20 inch alloy wheels in black. Then, we also have the black roof bars, black wing mirrors, as well as the privacy glass on the rear. We also have a black window trim just there as well. Now, I do have front and rear parking sensors with rear reversing ca camera, power assisted rear tailgate up and down. We also have dual exhaust flush with a rear bumper and rear diffuser. Now this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches and really does look superb from every angle, especially in that silver colour. Now if you're heading inside the car, we do have full leather seats throughout, pull down leather armors, we also have isofix points, storage panel driver and passenger seat and we also have integrated speakers and electric windows in the back as well. Coming to the front, there's a look at the driver's full leather seat which is heated electric. And the electric function is just there. We have electric power folding mirrors with electric windows. We also have the electric tailgate and also a button to lower the rear tow hook. Now we do have auto lights just there as well. As well, foot on the brake, we do have keyless start. And as you can see, it is free for any warning lights on the dash and is covered just over 16,220 miles. Now, coming to the centre, we do have two heated front seats which works just as you would expect it to. We also have dual zone climate control, which again works just as you would expect it to. We also have ice cold air com, which really does make a difference for those hot summer days. Now in the centre we do have satellite navigation, as well as media connectivity, which is two media interfaces, which is USB. We also have Bluetooth audio. We also have disc and memory card there as well. We have DB radio. Telephone connectivity via Bluetooth, and if you press the telephone button again, we do have Android Auto and Apple CarPlay just there as well. Pop the car into reverse, you have the rear reversing camera just there, there's also front and rear parking sensors just there as well. That flickering you see on the screen is just rolling shutter, which is the camera phone, so nothing to worry about on this vehicle. Now we do have storage in here as well, as well as just in front of you, two nice size cup holders, different drive modes where we do have off-road slippery comfort sport and also individual now we have manual mode downhill ascent assist and this is what you just control everything happens on the screen soft touch leather armrest with storage in there as well and there's a look at the passengers full leather seat now this vehicle is available to take away today with free console is nationwide next day delivery it's hbi clear comes with fresh service new and we do offer competitive low finance thank you very much for watching test drive of this Mercedes-Benz Jolie 250D AMG line 4 Matic. Now the purpose of this video test drive is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you would expect it to. As you can see, I'm not to fight with steering wheel to keep it a straight line, it is going very central. Now I do have paddle shift, if you wish to turn the car into manual mode, we also have cruise control and speed limit just down here. Now to activate the cruise control, simply push down and then it'll go to the nearest miles an hour. Push up very slightly, or just by one, and push up until you feel a bit of a click, and then just name as five. Now to cancel, simply either push away or press the brake, and then it will let cancel. So right now, I'm going to the random out, I'm going to take a left, as you would if you were driving this vehicle today. And I'm also going to take over the paddle shift now as well. So I'm probably in fourth, go drop down to third, into fourth, into fifth, and then to let the car take back over, simply just push down on your gear selector drive. Now in the centre we do have satellite navigation as well as DAB radio, Bluetooth phone and Bluetooth media connectivity. Now we do also have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto built into this vehicle. Now to activate them you simply just plug your phone into the USB port and then it will then go on automatically. Now I do have a very comfortable full leather seats which can easily do two, three, even 400 miles in this vehicle but still get out feeling fresh. We also have an ice cold aircon, so for hot days like today, it really does make all the difference. Now, both front seats are also heated and electric, as the electric function is on the doors, just as you see there. And then the heated function is also just down here as well. Next, you stop start where you can also put in your, power, um, your parking sensors on and off, and also where your traction control button is. 
Now I do have different drive modes, just down here as well, which you control with the little knob, where we have individual sport. Comfort, slippery and off-road. Obviously, off-road is for going off-road. Slippery for those winter conditions where the roads may be slightly slippery, and then it will then reduce the power so it makes it easier to have traction on the road. Now, if you're driving this vehicle today, you'd be listening out for any, un any unwanted knocks or bangs. If you've been listening out during this test drive video, there hasn't been any, which is always a bonus when buying a used car. Now, we are a five-star dealership with over 300 five-star reviews on Google, Auto Trader, and Car Gurus. And if you read through the reviews, our customers really do re reiterate the fact of how we'd be able to buy for and how caring of a company we actually are. But right now, I'm currently to the industrial state, and I'm going to take a right, I'm going to perform an emergency stop just to show that the brakes work as they should, and also put it straight into reverse just so that the, you can go into reverse as well, to show that the rear reversing camera works as it expected to. So, indicating to pull it now, I should be able to do with an emergency stop straight away. So, I'm going to do with the emergency stop in three, two, one, and now. As you can see, no issues whatsoever, and straight into reverse again, no issues whatsoever. And you can see in the, in the sense just there, the rear reversing camera. Now, if you have answered all of your questions and inquiries during this test drive and walk around video, please feel free to get in contact with the sales team, where they can answer any unanswered questions and inquiries, and also book you in for a test drive and reviewing of your selected vehicle. But, I hope this was help helpful, and we wish to hear from you soon. Cheers!